I am recording this video in this awesome seaside setup. This is the town of Puducherry, which used to be a French colony before. I am by the side of the Pondicherry beach. Now I'm going to record some footage with a 1.33 anamorphic lens and I'm going to show a special advanced feature on the S24 Ultra for footage recorded with the anamorphic lens. This is the anamorphic de-squeeze function available in the S24 Ultra. You don't need an advanced camera app, you don't need any other app. The native camera app itself has got this function of uh, anamorphic de-squeeze. To get this, it is not available in the normal camera mode. You have to download the camera assistant function from the Galaxy shop, Galaxy store and uh, then enable it while recording anamorphic footage after attaching the anamorphic lens. You can also get similar long aspect footage with the full video mode available in the S24 Ultra. I will compare both kinds of footage for you. But the anamorphic squeeze, anamorphic footage is more longer with a longer horizontal aspect ratio than the full or Panasonic aspect ratio which is normally available in the phone itself. You don't have to use an anamorphic lens for this, nor do you have to de-squeeze the footage in the post. So I take this uh, Platero anamorphic lens and uh, will place it over the central lens of the camera like that. So this is footage recorded on the S24 Ultra with the screen recording on with the, with the anamorphic lens placed over the central lens. Now we will apply that. So to do that I will go to the camera options open the camera assistant function here and then you have this anamorphic lens correction here 1.33 I'll en enable this anamorphic lens correction So this uh, de-squeeze footage is applied to all 16 by 9 ratio videos shot in pro video mode. So you have to shoot it in pro video mode unless they are shot in 8K, HDR10 or 120 frames per second. So. If you want to record pro video with the S24 Ultra with the anamorphic lens which I just showed you then you need to get use an ND filter this is an ND filter adapter which will go over the ND filter on the phone and, the, and this is the 8 ND filter from Hoya. I am using a variable density ND filter, the 8 ND filter didn't work. So with this variable density ND filter, if you turn it on, this is anamorphic footage in 16 by 9 aspect ratio. The anamorphic de-squeeze 
is applicable only in the 16 by 9 aspect ratio. I hope this video will inspire you to capture some awesome video with your favorite smartphone and gimbal. If this video inspires you, then you could consider subscribing to this channel. Thank you so much.